the weather could affect you more so than, than the price. In 2012 we decided to go into dairy and 13 we started milking. March 2013 we started milking uh, probably 50, 55 cows. We're at 130 cows today on 70 hectare platform. Fairly heavy farm. Um, the wet weather doesn't suit us here. We're 900 feet above sea level, so it can be tough at times. Um, we've been doing, I suppose, the gobbles are receding and plan to do a lot more in the next couple of years and look at soil fertility. I suppose we hadn't really looked at soil fertility up to now and we're going to be looking at it now in the next couple of years and really focusing on, on improving the indices going forward. Um, I suppose out of the programme I want to get is, I suppose, more grass growing on the farm. Uh, soil fertility, all that up to scratch, uh, become more efficient, I suppose, uh, and sustainable in the future. Um, I suppose with the, the climate change and the environment coming down the road, there is going to be more regulation on farmers, and I suppose we have to be able to farm in a commercial way and also be environmentally friendly along with that. Yeah, I suppose protected area there is environmentally friendly, I suppose, compared to the other forms of nitrogen and we have been using a bit this year and, and next year now we'll probably use a lot more of it and, and there seems to be good results from, coming from it already there. Uh, I suppose bread and slurry is another one. Um, we've used uh, the umbilical system I suppose this year with the, the, the trail and shoe on it and it works well I suppose, especially in, in wet ground I suppose for me it's, it's a good job in the springtime and uh, that seems to work well as well. So it does. I suppose uh, other things in the result of the programme we're going to be looking at energy usage and water usage on the farm. This meter is going to be installed for measuring energy and water and it's going to be related back I suppose to how much energy and, and water is being used to produce the milk on the farm. Uh, in relation to suppose, biodiversity on the farm, I suppose we're lucky enough here we have a lot of mature trees and hedgerows. Um, around most fields there's, there's hedgerows so I suppose it's a matter of maintaining them now and managing them a bit better maybe in the future for bio biodiversity. In relation to labour on the farm, we have myself full time and I suppose I have a man comes in there two, three days a week to give me a hand as well. And that's kind of it then.